my warmest congratulations to the graduating class of 2020, wherever you are in the world at this time. It's my great pleasure to welcome you all, undergraduate students, master's students and researchers alike, to this graduation celebration today. I'm so sad it can't be in person. This year, you've all faced many challenges, but I want to thank all graduates for your magnificent achievements and hard work, which we're celebrating today. I'm delighted you've been able to join, albeit virtually, and perhaps can celebrate wherever you are with family and friends. I want to also thank those family and friends for the support and encouragement they've given to you during your studies. This has been so important to your successes. When you decided to study at the University of Manchester, you chose to make a major investment in your future. I just hope this has paid the dividends throughout the time you've been with us. When many of you started your degree last September or returned to Manchester, it was a very different world to the one in which you've completed your studies, one that none of us could ever have envisaged or ever planned for. Achievements this year in these unprecedented times are even more remarkable. Resilience, adaptability, and above all else, huge achievements in your academic studies. You've gained the skills and knowledge to help you find success in future years. In fact, many of our medical and healthcare professionals celebrating this week finish their courses early to join the front line and tackle the COVID-19 pandemic head on. All of your achievements in completing your degree this year cannot be overestimated for its value on the strong platform it gives you to build your career and achieve your goals. Armed with your academic success, your skills and your breadth of experiences, there is every reason to be positive about the future. Your career prospects, having studied here, are enviable because employers all around the world recognise the value of the award that you have gained. But I hope that you've also gained so much more than a degree. I hope that you've gained experiences, friendships and wider skills. Obtaining your degree is a hugely important milestone and you should celebrate your success. Maybe not quite in the way you had envisaged in this remarkable, but it is still a remarkable achievement. This is the beginning of the journey and your association with Manchester, not the end. The Alumni Association will help you to remain in contact with the university, linking you with a community of more than half a million Manchester graduates living and working across the globe. You are now part of that huge global family. So we sincerely hope that today will not be your last contact with the university. And remember that our doors will always be open to you. Congratulations and my warmest good wishes again. Thank you. My name is Brian Heafy and I'm the head of the School of Social Sciences and Vice Dean for the Faculty of Humanities. And I'm here to say congratulations. Really well done. It's been a tough year for some of you, if not most of you, in terms of trying to finish your degrees in these strange times in which we live. But I want to tell you about how proud I am and my colleagues are of your achievements and your successes. You've done incredibly well, and I think you should be very proud to be graduating at this time of the year. As you know, your studies and some of our activities have been disrupted by the COVID-19 issues we face this year. But despite that, you have pushed on and triumphed in your studies. And here you are today, graduating. And unfortunately, we can't be together. And usually we are together at this time of the year. So you're probably missing some of your peers. But hopefully, you will get an opportunity to communicate them and with them in one way or another. And importantly, I would like to say also congratulations to your families and your friends, your partners, and those who have support, supported you 
through the year, through the duration of your studies. Some of you are graduating today on your undergraduate degrees, and that is three years of study and support you've had from your close networks. Some of you are graduating from master's degrees, and that will have entailed quite a lot of effort on your parts, but also efforts on other parts, other people's parts in supporting you. And some of you will be even graduating with PhDs today, maybe after three to five years study. And I have to say that I personally am delighted that you have done such a great job. And I am also a bit sad that I can't be there to celebrate this with you and that my colleagues can't be there in person to celebrate with you. But in the future, we hope to meet you under different circumstances where we can recognize your achievements. So everyone who's graduating at the, in this group um, is graduating with a degree from within what's broadly termed the social sciences. The common thing amongst you, even though you come from eight very dis different disciplinary backgrounds, it might seem, uh, is that you will have developed knowledge and skills in processing, analyzing, synthesizing complex information and data, and applying these to social, cultural, political, economic, legal, and technological trends and to aspects of social life that really matter on the ground to people and to groups. Of course, one of the things is that in some senses we say goodbye to you now, but we also hope that some of you will stay on for further study, particularly undergraduate and postgraduate taught uh, students who are graduating today um, may stay on to do PhDs, may stay on to do master's uh, degrees and so on. But another way in which we hope to keep contact with you is through our alumni community. You are now part of a much wider network of an international network of ex-students or alumni, for not want of the proper word, um, which remain essential to our ways of connecting with the world. So you will be invited to be a part of that community, and we hope that you will be an active part of that after finishing your studies. So what I want to say at the end of this is that you have done incredibly well. And I think you need to acknowledge that. And I think you need to find ways right now to enjoy that in safe ways uh, with those who are close to you. In time, it may feel a bit scary now going into outside of education and going into or going back into the labor market, but things are looking positive on the front of vaccines and so on. And I am sure that my colleagues will join me in saying, we wish you all the best for the future. It's been a pleasure to have you here and it will be a pleasure to connect with you again, either as students in the future again, or as or part of our alumni community. So take care, enjoy yourselves, and thank you for the contribution you've made to our academic lives. Hello, my name is Yen Kong Hodu and I'm Head of Department of Law. Congratulations to all our prize winners and to all of you graduating today. I hope you have enjoyed your time with us. 
I wish you all the best for the future. As the head of criminology, I have great pleasure offering congratulations to all our graduates. It's been a really memorable year and we're certainly going to remember you. We're proud of you and we wish you the very best. Please stay in touch. Hello everyone. I'm Tarani Chindola, the head of Department of Social Statistics in the School of Social Sciences. I just wanted to give my congratulations to all our students graduating today, especially those on our undergraduate, masters and PhD programs. Well done. Okay, well done on behalf of everyone on the philosophy department for a really great achievement in an extremely challenging year. Congratulations. As the head of the Department of Policies and International Relations here at the University of Manchester, it's my privilege to be able to pass on my warmest congratulations to all of you graduating this winter. You are the class of 2020. Can I also take this opportunity to pass on my congratulations also to all of our prize winners. You should be rightly proud of your achievements. It's done, you've done fantastically well. All of you, do please stay in touch. We miss you already. Congratulations to the prize winners in economics and congratulations to all our graduands. I hope you've enjoyed studying with us and I wish you all the best of luck for the future. Congratulations to everybody graduating today. We've really enjoyed having you with us and we wish you all the best for the future. Congratulations to all students graduating in anthropology. You've done great work in the most difficult of years. Well done and best wishes for all your future endeavours. Congratulations to everyone graduating this December. As PGR Director for the School of Social Sciences, I'd like to particularly congratulate those of you who are getting your PhDs. What a year to finish your PhD in. Phenomenal achievements. So well done from all of us, and I really look forward to hearing about your futures. Well done. Hi, this is Matthew Patterson. Uh, congratulations to all our politics graduates this year, uh, especially the group I taught in politics of climate change, and Zach Hardy for his dissertation. Uh, best wishes for the future. Hi, this is Pete Grease, Professor of Chinese Politics, with a hearty congratulations to the class of 2020. Hello all. I wanted to wish everyone graduating today a massive congratulations especially those who took the MA in Human Rights and Human Rights with Law. You should all be really proud of yourselves. This is an incredible achievement. I wish you all good luck with everything in the future. Congratulations to our Criminology graduates and to everybody graduating in 2020. Congratulations to all of you on your graduation today and a particular shout out to our Peace and Conflict Studies students. Please stay in touch. We would like to know where your adventures are taking you and we're wishing you all the best. Everybody, I just want to wish you all a huge congratulations for having graduates, uh, for passing your MA degrees. Uh, well done, all of you. Uh, it was done under very difficult circumstances. You're very proud of yourselves. A uh, special shout out for those who did my modules, the Ethics of Killing and uh, Democracy Theory and Practice. Really enjoyed teaching them to you uh, and engaging with you on these topics and uh, wish you all the very best for the future and I hope you stay in contact. Huge congratulations to everyone graduating, particularly if you took my EU foreign policy module and double particularly if you're Cecilia, Callum, Nadia or Ingrida 
the completing MA European Politics. Congratulations, everyone. Congratulations on your diploma. This has been a challenging year for everybody. And still, you managed to complete your degree. Well done. Now enjoy and celebrate. Hi, I'm Lisa Williams, a senior lecturer in criminology. Congratulations to all students, especially criminology students, on your graduation. As a man director of the whole politics program, I want to congratulate all of you on your amazing achievement this year. I had the pleasure of meeting many of you in various ways during the year, and I am very proud of all of you, and I want to wish you all the best for the future. A big shout out to those who have taught for gender war and peace or supervise. It was a joy to see you all develop. And also to Dr. Jen Hobbs, I'm honoured to say that I supervised you on your amazing PhD. Congratulations to all of you, and I hope that you all have a wonderful celebration of your achievements. Hello, I'd just like to offer a word of thanks and congratulations to anybody who did my first 19 politics course and to wish you all the very best with whatever you do in the future. Politics graduates, congratulations. Enjoy your success and I look forward to whatever comes next. Hi everyone, just a short message from me to send you all huge congratulations on your graduation. This is no mean achievement given the very difficult situation you've all coped with this year. And I'd like to give a special mention to all the criminology students that I've had the pleasure of getting to know. You have the academic foundations now to support you in whatever you'd like to achieve and to make a difference in the world. And please do stay in touch with us, we'd love to hear what you're up to. Hello guys. Uh, this is Michael Galanis and uh, Jess M. Tarone and Nikki Butler. Uh, you probably remember us from last year. Uh, I'm the uh, Jess M. and I are the PGT directors and uh, Nikki, the uh, LLM director. So uh, big congratulations from from us. It's a shame that we cannot be in the same room together, but uh, I wish you the best for uh, from now on. Guys, uh, like Michael said, we're really sorry that you're not uh, here for your graduation. We're really sorry that we're not doing this in person. We just wanted to say a quick congratulation. It's been a pleasure uh, to teach you. It's been a pleasure to know you. We're very, very proud of you. We're very proud of what you've achieved. And I'm sure, like Michael and Nikki, you're going to achieve your potential. And you're going to be great, great uh, professionals. Thank you very much for coming to Manchester and see you soon. Keep in touch. Hi guys, everything that they said, massive congratulations, keep in touch and take care. Congratulations to everybody graduating this December, but a special shout out to all the sociology uh, graduates on the master's programmes. Uh, really well done and I hope you have a fabulous celebration. Well done, many congratulations to all the Politics MA students graduating in 2020. Congratulations to all of our students who are graduating in December 2020. A particular congratulations to the postgraduate taught students in healthcare, ethics and law. It was a real pleasure to teach you and I hope you'll keep in touch with us. Hello everyone, uh, as Director of Student Experience, I want to say a huge congratulations to you all for your incredible achievement. Uh, you should be very, very proud of yourselves. I also want to thank you for the amazing contribution you've made to our institution and we look forward to working with you in the future. Congratulations. Well, this is congratulations to all of the people leaving the Masters in Social Anthropology this year. And we're incredibly proud of your success in such an extraordinary time as we've had since the beginning of our semester two on the course that you've taken. So social anthropology, this is for you. And this is to congratulate you guys in the Masters for Visual Anthropology. You've done an amazing job under very, very difficult circumstances. So we are also extremely proud of you, me and all of the other members of the Granada Center for Visual Anthropology. Well done, congratulations. Massive congratulations on finishing your degree. Uh, I know it's been a really tough year, but you've done it. Um, and a shout out to the master's students of international relations. Um, you've done a really stellar job this year. I would like to offer many congratulations uh, to all our PhD students uh, in the Department of Law. Richard Brandt, uh, Creton Dionysiu, Peter Sean Byrne, Elizabeth Chloe Romanis, Daniel 
Bianchi and Maria Apostolaki for successfully de defending their PhDs. The best of luck uh, with your careers uh, and your life more generally. And I do hope that you stay in touch with uh, the colleagues in the University of Manchester. Congratulations to all the MA students graduating this year. You've been brilliant to teach and to work with and you deserve all the credit in the world for getting to where you have. Well done. I want to say a huge congratulations to you all. We're so lucky to have such fantastic students and so I hope that all of you who did our MSc, our LLM and our MA in healthcare ethics and law will have a fantastic time celebrating with your families. You all did so brilliantly, particularly in this very difficult year. So I'm wishing you um, the very best for the future and please do keep in touch. Thank you. Congratulations! Big congratulations to everyone graduating from the Political Theory Pathways. Really well done to all of you. Many congratulations to all of you graduating today and a special mention to those of you who are taught over the course of your degree programmes. It's been an absolute pleasure and I wish you all the very best for your future. Congratulations to all of you on the successful completion of your master's studies. Special congratulations to the great group of students who took RME in Peace and Conflict Studies and to all other students who took my modules. I wish you best of luck in the future and I hope to stay in touch. Hi, uh, congratulations everyone, um, especially those of you on the sociology program. Uh, take care um, and good luck. Congratulations everybody, you've done so well to complete your studies. We're all really proud of you and you should be proud of your achievements. Big shout out to everyone on the MA International Political Economy. You were a pleasure to teach and we wish you every success. A big congratulations from me too. Um, celebrate well and wishing you all the best for your next adventures. Hi everyone, huge congratulations to all those graduating from the class of 2020 today and especially to those who took my Theories and Rights module. It's an absolute pleasure teaching you and I wish you all the very best for whatever it is you go on to in the future. Take care. Jean and I would like to congratulate everyone who's graduating today, especially those in the international law streams. It's been a tough year, especially the teaching stopped in March. So you've all done really well and um, congratulations. To all of you on completing this, uh, this important degree, uh, notwithstanding the challenging circumstances, we're very proud to count you all among our alumni now. We wish you to use all these skills and aptitudes you've acquired over the last 12 months for a good cause and we're very confident you will make the world a better place. All the best to all of you. A huge congratulations to all of you students graduating today. Students on the economics programmes who took advanced microeconomics with me and PhD level advanced microeconomic theory. I loved working with you and I wish you all the best for your futures. Hi everyone, I'm Tim Oliver. I'm the Programme Director for Democracy and Elections and I just want to say congratulations to all of our graduates in the class of 2020. We're all immensely proud of you. Hello everyone, a massive congratulations to all of you graduating this month, especially the master students I taught and supervised and Lewis Bassett Yarrell for passing his PhD. I wish you all the best for the future. Best of luck, my warmest congratulations on your fantastic achievement at your graduation. Uh, the future ahead of you is really, really exciting and we, your academics, are very proud of yourselves. Best of luck. Many congratulations on your graduation from all of us in CFEP. We're really proud of you and we're sorry that we can't be there with you today to celebrate with you. But we're thinking of you and we'd be really delighted if you keep in touch in the future and let us know how you're getting on. Really enjoy the day. My heartfelt congratulations to all MA students graduating from politics programs. Your achievement is frankly quite incredible. You completed your MA studies and dissertations under very challenging conditions. I hope you will use the knowledge and skills that you developed during your MA studies for something beautiful and meaningful. And I hope whatever you do in your life will make you very happy. 
I wish you all the best in your future. As Director of Teaching and Law, I'd just like to say very many congratulations on your graduation. It really is a great achievement and I wish you all the very best in your future career. Congratulations to everyone for completing your postgraduate degrees in such a difficult year. Uh, particular message to the uh, students on the MA in Political Economy program. It was a pleasure to know you, to teach you, and um, please do keep in touch. Congratulations. Huge congratulations to our students in the Department of Law and special congratulations to our students on the MA Healthcare Ethics and Law. I wish you every success in the future. Congratulations to the class of 2020 and best of luck in all of your future endeavors. Congratulations to the class of 2020. It's a huge achievement and you have plenty to celebrate. My name is Maureen Free, and I graduated in the class of 2015 with a Master's in Political Economy. I found my University of Manchester degree to be a real stepping stone to success in the career path I chose to follow, which is a career in the civil service. I have held research, policy and communication positions across the Home Office, Foreign Office and Department for International Trade, and I've worked on policy priorities as diverse as hate crime, violence against women, the UK-France bilateral relationship and US trade, including the World Trade Organization. Most recently, I returned to the Home Office to lead overseas development assistance programmes to deliver on homeland security priorities across Africa and Asia. My Manchester degree provided a strong basis from which to understand and interrogate the complex policy areas I tackle on a daily basis, and that has enabled me to critically think through evidence-based solutions to real-world problems. There is a real appetite for people who can think and work in this way across the entire job market, and the School of Social Sciences will have no doubt put you through the paces and prepared you well. You are graduating into a challenging job market, but you're leaving uni with the skills and community around you to grip what comes next. My advice for graduates starting work would be to remember that your support network, including the uni and your course friends, are there to help you with your resilience, which is all the more important in the times that we live in. Our success is more often than not a collective effort of lifting each other up. So my advice is to not be embarrassed to ask for help, and likewise to offer support and give each other a leg up when you feel you can. I would recommend you stay in contact with the alumni network too. There is a strong international Manchester community and you never know where the right contact might take you. So you've already proven to yourself and everyone else that you have what it takes. 2020 has been a year for the history books for sure and that makes your graduation this year all that more exceptional. So once again a huge congratulations and best of luck in your careers. Hello everyone, my name is Bradley Mather and I graduated from the University of Manchester with an undergraduate degree in law in 2015 and a master's degree in healthcare ethics and law in 2018. I'd like to say a huge congratulations to you all on graduating and on taking such an important step towards your future careers. Reflecting on my time at Manchester, the thing I valued the most about my experience was the fantastic teaching I received from academics who were also practitioners and leaders in their fields, as well as the opportunities that were available to me by way of extracurricular activities, such as my work in the University Legal Advice Clinic. All of this prepared me well for moving from academic study into legal practice. Since graduating from Manchester, I've gone on to work in legal practice and I'm due to be called to the Bar of England and Wales next year. My experience at Manchester has undoubtedly had a huge influence on these achievements and I have no doubt that your experience at Manchester will have a huge influence on your future too. I've always been asked about my degree in interviews with enthusiasm and I have no doubt that with the fantastic range of degrees within the School of Social Sciences, you will all be very attractive to future employers. I recall being told on my graduation that being part of the university does not end with your time there and I've experienced this myself with the support I have received both in continuing my studies and after leaving the university such as help with applications. I've also met alumni in my chosen field who have always been happy to provide help and support. In that regard I would encourage you all to keep in touch with the university make connections with alumni in your chosen field and make use of the fantastic alumni services on offer, which includes continued access to the library and opportunities for mentoring. I would again like to say huge congratulations to you all 
and hope that you all have a fantastic day celebrating. Thank you. So many best memories make up my Manchester experience. Uh, I met my now fiance here, which is obviously pretty high on the list. Um, I met so many lovely people, and I spent far too much money on big hands. Um, but I'd say that the entire dissertation process really takes the cake. Uh, the sense of accomplishment and pride I felt submitting it after months of work is a feeling I'll never forget. Speaking about the best memory of Manchester, I would like to say it was the first time that I stayed alone. But still, I had the greatest set of friends, the entire circle of friends who became family. And this family of friends made Manchester a complete memorable one. I cannot pick one certain moment to say it was amazing and memorable because everything happened in the past years are very amazing and very memorable. My favourite memory of Manchester from this year has to be the Reclaim the Night March. Loads of students marched from Farley Field all the way to campus, singing and chanting, and then we listened to some really inspirational talks. The whole atmosphere was just incredible. Being able to see my friends so easily, whether grabbing a quick coffee on campus or going to the quiz on a Monday night in the SU. I guess the general vibe running through the city and its people. I miss the constant challenge, both academically and otherwise. Um, I won't miss the weather, but I will miss the palpable excitement of a sunny day and the way that everybody takes to the park to celebrate the occasion. The most important lesson for me is Statistical Foundation. I was from a very sociological background and have very few knowledge about statistics and math. Thanks to my lecture, Eduardo and Natalie, they built my confidence about math and statistics. Uh, studying here completely opened my worldview and broadened my perspective. Um, I met and learned from people all over Europe and from all over the world. Um, and even outside of everything I learned on my course, that experience, I think, made me a better political scientist and, I hope, a better person. One thing I've learned this year is that when you're learning about what you're passionate about, the work is so much easier. A lot of patience and hard work, without which doing assignments wouldn't be possible. Therefore, the most valuable lesson learned was to manage time and to have perseverance in whatever I do. Manchester, both as a city and its people, really pulls you in. It's, uh, it's a really special, welcoming place. And I think Manchester will always feel like a second home to me for that reason. Staying in Manchester has been a life-changing experience for me. Manchester for me was like a light at the end of the tunnel. Do what you want to do, even though it's very difficult for you at the moment. Ask what you want to ask but you don't understand at the moment. Keep going and keep improving. I hope all of you have a bright future. Good luck. Well done, we made it. And if you could do a master's degree in a pandemic, then you can do pretty much anything. Courage in danger. Steadiness in time of testing, perseverance in difficulty, loyalty when royalty is costly, love which nothing can change, and joy which nothing can take away.